Here we go at Geronimo. Up just north of the 202. Nice little area, lots of food and restaurants, groceries, real close, formal dining room right as you walk into your left, and the formal living room off to the right. And theoretically, you could make this into a sixth bedroom if you wanted to also. Moving in to the right, we have one of the bedrooms. And the powder room. Nope, full bath. Just kidding. Got a little wet bar next to kitchen, family room, opens to the backyard. Plants is a little bit outdated, might need new ones. Well lit, nice open area. It's nice to have a plug-in right in the middle of the floor, already installed. On this side we have full bathroom. Turn on the lights so we can see in there a little bit. All the way back to the shower and toilet. Sinks up front. And we have bedroom two. Bedroom three. And then bedroom four. All relatively normal sized. Then to the other side, we have the garage access and the master bedroom over here. So in through here, it's about the same size as Tonto. You see we have some cabinets in here, but if you look at the back wall, you notice you have about the same spacing on that side as you do in Tonto. This one does have central vac already installed. And gas, hot water as well. This one has the home network right in the back of the door or behind this door. It means you can do what I did was put my modem up top and router and that way I could hardwire into different rooms, my computer, make it faster and more secure. Master bedroom, got a little office over there. This is a linen closet. Does have a little makeup area. It's in the bathroom. The toilet doesn't have a door on it. And plenty of space. And tiled flooring in the closet. Well, let me know what you think.